so they basically being blunt they couldn't do black hair yes hold on so this is an african country yes congo in downtown congo point downtown congo point no yes but they can't do hair for african or black women yes I'm ready to see what we've got today. So tell me, tell me. Oh, oh wow, congratulations. Thank you. Okay, so Livara is a hair and cosmetics company. So Livara mm -hmm. is a brand mm -hmm. that manufactures natural and organic cosmetics. Okay. Based on shea butter okay. and other natural oils that we found mainly in Uganda. Okay, oh, okay. Yes. Interesting. So when you say organic, you mean there's no chemical. There's no chemical fertilizer. There's no animals feeding wherever it is that we get our resources. Oh from. wow! Okay. It's organic. It's natural. Mm -hmm. Nature only. Okay. Yes. Oh, very interesting. So I'm a first class electrical engineer. Uh, uh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. 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 <laughs> anyway, so um, I was working with uh, Schlumberger. Best in Congo as a petrol. How do you say that? You say it's so so fancy. Schlumberger. <laughs> I've been I've been saying Schlumberger. Yes, and I was best in Congo. Okay. However, with my time in Congo, I realized that there was nothing mm -hmm. that was African, intrinsically African. But my journey starts at the time when I needed to relax my hair. Okay. When I was three months into the job, uh -huh. I had the normal relaxed hair, mm -hmm. and the three months timeline for you know yeah relaxing it. Yeah. I went to look for a salon to do my hair uh -huh. and all the three salons I went to were owned by the French but then it was the African ladies working however they couldn't work on my hair because apparently they didn't have the resources to work on my hair yet they were in Congo. Wait hold on so they basically being blunt they couldn't do black hair. Yes. Hold on so this is an African country. Yes. Congo. In downtown Congo. Point downtown Congo. Point no yes. But they can't do hair for African or black women. Yes. So anyway, what I did when I failed to get three salons to work on me, my next salon I went to was a barber shop mm -hmm. where I completely cut off my hair. And that's where the anger with all this mess started. And I decided I resolved to do something about it. Wow. So that's when I started noticing that oh my god, we're in Africa, everything is imported. There's, I mean, eggs, meat, everything, um, everything, and also I can't get my hair worked on in Congo. That is shocking. I actually had no that idea was, that was like your that boiling was, point. Yes. So I decided to start saving up. Mm -hmm. I started looking around for raw materials that I would use to, you know, make my hair. Mm -hmm. And that's when I learned of coconut oil, like all the that. oils. Mm -hmm. Then I involved my sister Gloria, she's a doctor, and she advised me to check into um, shea butter. Mm. Then I discovered it was a natural African oligopoly, and the one in Uganda was the best. As you move east from the west, mm -hmm. in the 15 countries in which it's found, mm -hmm. it gets better as you move um, east for cosmetics mm -hmm. and pharmaceutical purposes. So during my short vacations, I would come to just survey and do market studies. Mm -hmm. I wrote a business plan. Um, asked uh, Madame <laughs> to told her about the plan, and mm -hmm. then she told me about Yuri. She's one actually brought me here, took me around, and then I saw the value that Yuri adds. When she told me about this, I requested for her to set for me up uh, an appointment. Mm -hmm. But she told me all she's doing is setting up the appointment. What I do in there? Go and embarrass yourself or make yourself <laughs> proud. I can see her saying that. <laughs> I, I know Jaja. <laughs> so um, I had to prepare, like literally prepare. So when my meeting date finally arrived, mm -hmm. I had my numbers down to the T. Um, professor told me bluntly that he thinks I'm ambitious, but he has seen ambitious, young, intelligent people. They usually come and they disappear after three months. So I told him, watch the space. Um, five months after my appointment with him, that was in January mm -hmm. 2015, I quit my job when I had raised my savings to about $50,000. Oh wow. I quit and decided to come to nothing. To and just started to start all on your own. From scratch. So we're going to go to the lab. Yes. And you're going to show me how you make your lipstick. How we make the okay. lipstick. Okay, let's go. <laughs> let's go. Thank you. Okay. 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 Okay.
These wax? Okay. Remember the lipsticks are 100% natural. Yeah, I'm like, wow, okay. I like this, uh huh. This is beeswax. Beeswax? Yeah. And then, Kanuba wax. Oh, what? Kanuba wax. This we get from Brazil. Because they have the Kanuba kids. Oh, so symmetry. Yes. I might even try to sound dumb. I didn't know that was anything in my face. So this is really intriguing. Okay. Yes. All the natural products. So, the only thing that will make this spoil the natural beauty a little bit is the Yeah, that's understandable, but I love how. But this comes from oh, raw yes, extracts as well. Oh, so there's nothing here that's like chemically cooked. Mm -hmm. No, I love that. Okay, makes my lips feel safe. 100%. So this is an anti-snap treatment. Mm -hmm. There are some children whose hair keeps on snapping and falling off, yes. especially the middle part. Yeah. Yes. So when you leave the product in for about 30 minutes yes. and wash it out, it actually strengthens the hair and then it's made using carrots, okay. which are very rich in vitamin A and C, which, okay. is, which are essential for hair growth as well. So This I'll use on Imani when she's like five, because having <laughs> the product in for 30 minutes, girl, I know my baby. I know my girl. <laughs> But yes. I will definitely take these three. For sure. For sure. Yes. Thank you. I'll get them. Thank you Kevin. so much. Iman says thank you on my behalf. Thank you thank so you, much. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you for your time. Thank you too. And thank thanks you. for considering us for of this. We'll be very glad to be part of it. Thank you.
all the traffic. I saw Anita's there. I've seen it. Which Anita? Anita Barrel. And it looks so good. Yeah, I saw Rachel there as well. Rachel was helping set up. Hey, where did it go? I saw I just saw it on her. Maybe it was here. Oh, um, Rachel. There's a DJ. DJ. <laughs> <laughs> what? It's, it's a party to, or a super shop? Oh my god, that is so cute. It's going to take the whole the whole mall. Okay. <laughs> oh food. Oh, thank you. God. Yeah, like oh fly. my god, look. Yeah. You need to fly. Okay. Yeah, there's I'm food. ready. Like. I'm so happy I'm not driving. I couldn't. I don't like driving. I don't like driving when I'm wearing makeup. I don't know if that makes sense because you're so. I don't know. It's just something about driving when you're wearing makeup. Cheers, honey. Congratulations. Thank you so much. First tip and shop. My first tip and shop. This is my first time at this store. You know yes, it is. Why is it taking me so long? You're better late than never, yeah? yeah better late than never, exactly. I was waiting for the items, the cream de la cream, mm -hmm. and then to have all these fab things in mm -hmm. and invite my friends, have some champagne. I, I see a DJ as well. Yes, you have an in house DJ. You're so bougie. So, <laughs> this is like, thank I you, Nani. It's going to be one of my favorite stores. Oh, thank you so much. I can already see, like, I need earrings. Yes. I love earrings. Like, we have everything. plenty of earrings that I brought, like, from small size to all sizes. And, yeah. It's just fab. So, is it going to be a first open shop or are you doing another one? Um, I do it every end of the year. Okay. So, I target every end of the year, Please November. Have more. Do one, like, summer. I will, Easter, maybe, like, Easter. Easter time. Yes. What? Any festive season. I w I'm trying to. I'm growing it right now. Oh, how long have you had the store for? I've had it for six years. Wow! wow. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. Oh my gosh. For six years, we just expanded. Mm -hmm. Two years since the expansion. So wait, where were you before? The same, war? but we same place, but yeah. we had a smaller shop. So oh, we so expanded, expanded all the way to this side. So when did you expand? Um, the, uh, 2019. Oh, wow. 20, 2018 actually. Okay. Oh, wow. Yeah. Businesswoman Pam. Thank I you see. so much. Oh, I see. <laughs> Do you want to open other branches, or for now are you? I'm thinking of opening other branches, but for now I want to first nurture my baby and then yeah. That makes sense. It does. Oh, okay, let's, let's go sip and shop. Let's go sip and okay. shop, honey. Cheers. Come and let's shop. Yeah.